Hi and welcome to Fabric Bias. It is November 18th, 2024. I am not sure when I'll be able to get this video out because I am visiting my sister, so I'm not at home and I don't know when I'm going to get to my computer. Um, I won't be traveling home for a few more days uh, at any rate, so it definitely won't be the next few days. So I did want to show you, uh, this is a haul video because... Uh, I didn't come down here to do any shopping. I came out down here actually to help my um, mom out and help with another family member. Uh, my mom just decided to uh, sell her home and move in with my sister. And then while she was in the process of getting everything packed up, she hurt her back. And so she hasn't been able to really unpack that much. So I came down to help out kind of with that and with something else. So in the meantime, though, we have had some uh, time to go out and have some fun and go shopping. So I'm going to show you what I've done. Uh, yeah, I've done a little bit of damage. So mostly this is Dollar Tree, but there is a couple things I got here that is not Dollar Tree. So this right here is from Marshalls. And I think I got this, um, let's see, it was $16.99. There's the ticket on that one. So I got that and I got this. My sister found these at Marshalls because my daughter loves Care Bears. And that and these are super cute look at the little ears on this one on that one pair oh, super cute on it so i did get those from marshall's i i got this because they only had one i only got one uh, from hobby lobby on that so i would get more but uh, i only got the one and it wasn't on sale so uh i think that's it that we got outside of dollar tree so let me go into the dollar tree stuff now uh starting here so i got i've already eaten like two or three packs of these. I think I've been here for three days, four days. I can't remember Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Yeah, I've been here four days and I got these and I think I've eaten three of those already. These were the only ones of this brand that I noticed that were just the apples. The other ones had, the other, were fruits that had other things mixed in. Like I, I want to say that they had sugar, but I can't remember. There was a reason I didn't get them. Don't remember what it was, but I like these. They're really good. So I'm working on a craft that I want to do in my head, of course, um, and I need two-sided tape. And I was thinking the um, pop top tape. Well, it turns out that what um, Hobby Lobby calls pop dots is not what I was thinking was pop dots. And so first of all, I got this tape and I do like it, but it's thick and I wanted, oh, I'm sorry, not pop dots. I wanted glue dots. And this is actually foam tape, thicker, and it's not dots. It's a strip, um, but it would have worked um, for what I wanted. So first I got this, and I got three of them to make sure I had enough to do the project that I wanted to do. Way more than I needed, it, not just for this project, just because I wanted to have some. Because again, I don't have a Dollar Tree where I'm at, if I haven't said that yet. And um, so I... Kind of decided to buy spares so this was the next thing that i saw at another dollar tree and these are actually in rounds and i thought oh well maybe i'll get that because i'm not finding glue dots and even though my sister had said um she clued me in on something to go look for um i she wasn't with me on that trip i was with my other sister and um so i got those when these are also i don't know if you'll be able to see foam so it's not coming into view but hopefully you can see that uh, but I got those. Um, again, if I don't use it for this project, I'll use it for something else. So not a big deal on that. I'm going to try this. Try this. If it doesn't work, I'm going to try the thing that I did actually find that my sister from, and I went tonight and, and got um, that are actually glue dots. I'll show you those at the end or somewhere in the middle. Um, but I, if the glue dots don't work, if they're not strong enough, I'm going to go with these and then I'm going to go with these and something eventually will work with what I'm doing. I'm trying to make these little popsicle stick turkeys. <laughs> And using glue was a little hard. So I did find these. I'm taking those home to my friend. I think she'll really like those. There were um, different versions. I just picked the one version. I got two packs of that. And then I got some Kleenex. Now these may not make it home. Uh, my daughter really likes to make tissue pouches. And so I bought some more. I know we just ran out of them. I did buy some because that's cheaper than I can get them at home. But if I can't that's okay. I'll just leave those here and leave them for my sister to use. Um, I bought these for stocking stuffers and because all those bags that I made 
for Christmas to give out at Christmas. I want for some of them, I'm going to actually be putting stuff in them. And I thought that I wanted to put different kind of things that would be representative of what you could use the bag for. And so I did grab some of these. I didn't grab enough to fill all the bags, but I did. And I actually already, I bought them for stocking stuffers and I bought them also because I needed one. I've actually already opened one because I broke a nail. I broke a nail and had to cut my, all my nails. So, so I actually opened one because one was for me anyways. And um, yeah, so stocking stuffers there too. On that. And these two, I got these, two of these for stocking stuffers for my sons. And I don't know how useful they'll find them, but I thought they were kind of cool. So I got those. So those I can't, most of the reason I'm doing the video right now is because I'm going to be taking, like unpacking all of these to try to get them to fit better in my luggage so I can bring everything home because uh, you'll see there's a lot. Um, but these I won't be unpackaging and these I won't be unpackaging. I got these for a friend of mine. Um, there's three. I thought they were cool. They look, I think you might be able to snap Legos onto that. I'm really hoping so, but anyway, around it, they're really kind of cool um, on that. So these I bought, so I'm here. My mom's a quilter. And since I'm here kind of helping get her settled in and getting things unpacked, I've been looking at YouTube videos on um, Dollar Tree and how to organize sewing things, sewing stuff. And um, I didn't, one of the things I found in the videos was that people buy makeup brushes and um, to clean their sewing machines. And uh, this is the brush set that I found. There's, I don't think it's a makeup brush set, but it doesn't really matter. Brushes are brushes. And so I bought three sets because um, I have, my daughter has a machine out. I have a machine out and then I just thought extra and I thought, okay, I'm going to grab those. And then tonight, that was the other night, tonight I found these, which I really like and I'm hoping they work because I bought six sets of these because I liked them so much because look how little they are. Like there's my finger and look how little they are. This is a nail art tools. And, um, I just like the size of them. It comes, there's three brushes in a set. There's this big brush here and then there's one and you can see kind of the pink tip right there. So there's an angled brush. Oh, I don't know if it'll come into view, but there's three brushes in the box for $1.25. And I thought that's good. I think I might actually even be able to fit that in the little container, you know, the little drawer on my machine. And, but what I didn't notice was there's actually two kinds of sets. There's this one as well. So there's this one, and that's the box for that one. I don't know if you can kind of see the picture. And then this one's a little bit different. And um, I accidentally grabbed this one thinking it was this, but that's okay because this one's kind of cool too. I don't know what I'm going to use it for, not necessarily for sewing, but I, I might use like this tip here for paper crafting and making um, scoring uh, marks. And then these brushes I still might be able to use to clean my machine. They're really small on that. So I, the reason I'm keeping the boxes is because um, I don't have a Dollar Tree, but my sister lives here. So she has um, many, many Dollar Trees here because there's a lot. And so if I decide I like them, I know that I can take a picture of the box and um, she will get some for me and then ship them to me when she's shipping me other stuff. So, so I got that. So now I don't know what I'm going to do with these brushes here. Um, but I'll figure something out. Uh, these my sister put me on too. So um, in another pile way over here are some chalkboard stickers. A friend of mine right before I left was asking if anybody still had the small chalk you use for writing and um, not sidewalk chalk. And so I, I found the chalkboard sticker and I thought, oh, I'm going to bring those back to her because I'm not sure what project she was working on, but I thought it was kind of neat and maybe she could use it and then and i was like oh, i wonder if they have chalk here and my sister said no they have the chalk writers and i was no idea what a chalk writer is and now i do so this is it and so i grabbed two of these and um my sister said she's never used them before so she doesn't know how well they work but um we'll see i'm gonna give them to my friends and find out now this is not my doing well it is but it isn't <laughs> So my sister called me a few weeks ago when she was shopping at Dollar Tree and had, she had seen these. These are um, $1.25. And um, she's like, do you want me to pick some up for you? And I said, yeah, sure. And she said, how many? And I said, well, I have a ton of rotary cutters, but get me six. <laughs> Don't ask me why. I have no idea. Um, again, because they're $1.25, I got hooked, right? Um, so she picked up six of these for me. And I'm just, they're just here because I need to take them back with me so she doesn't have to ship them. But 
she got me the 45 inch ones which is the ones i use and she got me 60 which i don't remember if this again it was a few weeks ago i don't remember if i um i don't know if she even realized that some of them were 60 inches which is cool because i i don't have if i have a 60 i don't even i don't know where it is um so now i have a couple of 60s here and i don't know how good these are at all but that's okay we're gonna give them a go and um and then there's 45s, which I do have several of at home already. And then when I was shopping um, to yesterday, yesterday, because we've been to Dollar Tree literally every day, I think. Um, I They had the little ones, the 20s. I don't have, I think I have one of these. I don't use it that often, but I, I wanted the little one for going like around curves. Um, I don't do a lot of cutting that way, but I do do some. And I thought, and when I do, I think, oh, a smaller, smaller rotary cutter would be nice. Um, I should find the one that I've got, which I don't know where it is. <laughs> so instead for $1.25, I bought two on that. And I don't need this many rotary cutters. I, I just going to keep them because, um, I will probably, uh, use them in some way as a gift or, um, just hold on to them with the rest of my rotary cutters. Uh, I don't know because I'm nuts. I guess that's why. <laughs> so let me show you over here well let me show you okay so my sister put me onto these these are planters sea salt and vinegar peanuts and i love these and i can't get them where i'm at so and i mean my i think the only place we've been able to find them we have not that we've searched very hard is dollar tree and they don't have them always in stock but i got lucky they had them in stock pretty much at every dollar tree i went to and um so i grabbed a ton now i know all of these fit and one stack of these fit that second stack might not be able to get all those to fit and that's okay because i love them my sister loves them my sister's husband loves them <laughs> my other sister likes them so if i leave them behind it's going to be a-okay i'll be happy to do that and happy to use them for my sisters and um, my brother-in-law on that side yeah uh i i went a little crazy um okay so my sister found these too and i thought she handed me one and i'm like oh yeah i want to get that one and i got one and i thought that would make a cool stocking stuffer i'm gonna have to go back and get some more so i did i bought a whole bunch of them i didn't know how many i grabbed so i grabbed some more because i also am going to put these in the bags that i made i think i'm going to put some of them in and um, i'm going to use them as stocking stuffers and again i don't have a dollar tree and i like them i'm going to they're very practical. It, let's see how thin they are. They're magnetic and they... Flashlights. Great if the power goes out. You just stick them on your refrigerator. I'm like, that's a cool, cool light. And I actually have a flashlight on my refrigerator, but it's not thin like this. Um, so I think it's actually a nice idea uh, on that. And they're... If I didn't say so, they're magnetic. Let me see if which way it's going to stick. Yeah, there. They're magnetic. So I bought a bunch of those. These are stocking stuffers too for my um, kids. I went very practical for my husband. I got one tape. This also might not make it home. That's okay. Uh, before I go into that big pile, I'm going to go around over here, but let me show you these. So I have a pair of pliers that the spring is missing. It works. You just have to open it back manually and close it manually. So I thought, okay, for $1.25, I could probably replace that. And I know that my friend lost his pliers, and um, so I grabbed a pair for him, too. These are my friend at work. Um, we use those, actually, a lot. Um, I did buy some Chanel stems on my first stop by, um, but I decided that it's a good price, but I can get them online and not have to haul them home for almost as good a price. And so I decided I wouldn't get any more of these because I think I want more of these. I want to try to figure out a craft to do with these. I, I, years ago, I did some stuff with Chanel stems, but um, I got that for that reason. So I'll play with it. I got these to bring home for my husband. I think they looked interesting and I love dill pickle. I love dill pickle chips. Um, and I thought that he might like these because he likes the dill pickle chips too. So these are just taking home for my husband. Um, I, this was actually, I did actually make a list on my, before I came down here and this was on the list. I need a scrubber and for $1.25, I went ahead and bought two and then they didn't have the replacement heads. We went to two Dollar Trees or three Dollar Trees, didn't have the replacement heads. 
So I bought actually two more of these and took the heads off of them. And then when we went yesterday to another Dollar Tree, look, they have them. So I bought those just to show my sister and just to have extras because, again, no Dollar Tree. <laughs> I don't know when I'm coming back. And when I do come back, then that will be less stuff at that point to hold up. I thought this was fun. It's like washi tape, super, super thin. I don't know what makes washi tape washi tape, but I'll just say uh, it's tape, decorative tape. And I bought two of the same for a project. And I wanted to make sure I had plenty. I don't know. I'm not real enamored with that for the project that I'm thinking of, but that's okay. Um, this was because I am here helping my mom get organized and she's a quilter. And so I was watching those YouTube videos about organizing, um, how to organize sewing areas um, with Dollar Tree stuff. And um, this, these clips were recommended on a couple of the videos for organizing um, like projects. And I don't have any. So I got, I didn't get them for my mom because I, I, this is not, I was looking for big organization things, not little project organization. That's kind of a personal thing for a sewist. So um, I wasn't getting her for that. I got that for me and my daughter because I do like to clip pieces together because when I get, I like to cut it, you know, you get everything cut out. I like to clip it together with notes on it. And um, so I, I got these and then I went to another Dollar Tree and, and they had huge ones. And I thought, okay, I'm getting those too. Um, so because sometimes you just have a whole lot to put together. So I got the big ones and I got some little ones there. All right. So I got that for my husband, stocking stuffer. And I got these because I love the idea of the safety. They only had one package of it. Um, we don't use them now, but it's not a bad idea. So I grabbed some of those and I need some bobby pins. Um, let's see. These, my sister has put me onto these too. I really like these a lot. Uh, they, they're very refreshing. I, I really like them. And so, um, apparently they're hard to come by. Um, and they had three of them. And so I grabbed three of them and then I'm going to give one to my other sister who was asking me about them. So I'm going to give her one to try because she hasn't tried it yet. Magnetic hooks. And some USB cables just for spares for me. I think it's good to have spares. I actually bought at the first Dollar Tree, they had uh, a $5 USB-C cable. And I grabbed that because I didn't know they had these. And I just wanted to have an extra one while I'm flying. I only brought one and I thought, oh, it'd be good to have extras. And um, I know I don't have any extras at home. So um, I bought the $5 one, which I already unpacked and threw in my bag. And um, then I saw these and so I got a couple more. This I got, again, I was watching a video, and what, one thing I couldn't find um, was they have, apparently there are these lights that you can clip on to things, and people were saying that you can clip them on near your sewing machine and use them for extra light, which I, I think is a great idea. I couldn't find the clip on lights, but one user, um, YouTuber, and I don't know, I watched a ton of videos, and I don't know who it was, unfortunately, she took elastic bands and fitted over, she slipped it over the machine, and then clipped it the light to that and was able to point the light down onto her um, sewing area. So I got, I grabbed those for that reason and I'll be able to use them for other things as well. So I wanted those. Let me see if I would, everything in this pile, I think I did over here. I did everything over here. I didn't do this pile. I will come back to this pile in just a second. Over here, everything over here. And that's everything over here. Oh, let me show you these. So these are balloon glue and this is what i was looking for when i was buying those so this these are actually glue dots i opened one of them so you can see i don't know if you'll be able to see it pull it back Let's see i can't even see it so oh there they are yeah i don't know is it glistening enough oh it comes in and out of focus there it is. It's actually a glue dot. And that's actually what I was looking for for the project I was looking at. And I love me the, some glue dots for sure. <laughs> so I've already taken them out of the package, getting ready to ship them. But this is what the package looks like on that. There's a hundred in there. So I have definitely plenty to last me for a while here because I bought one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packages. And um, yeah, I'm set um, on that. So let me come back all the way over here to this pile here. So I got stickers for my daughter because my daughter loves stickers. 
and I think she'll like those. Um, and I saw this in a uh, YouTube video and then I saw it in the store and I thought, oh, I'm going to grab that because I do like this little size cutting board for paper crafting. Um, but I think I could use it in for small cutting needs too um, when I'm sewing. This I bought for my friend who was doing something with the chalk. I'm not sure what, but I thought this is a big chalkboard sticker and I thought oh, for $1.25 I'm going to get that for her and see what she's using for. More stickers for my daughter. These pocket charts, I actually need a couple pocket charts and I could make them, but for $1.25 that's just not worth my time to, to actually make it. Um, I think I have one of these, but I wasn't sure so I grabbed one. And some ribbon. These are really pretty ribbon. I saw someone else on YouTube had bought this ribbon. I think my sister has this ribbon too. On that, got that for a project, uh, not a sewing project, but a crafting project, and same thing. This is the project I'm kind of working on a popsicle stick project, and I'm going to see if these stickers work with that. If not, I'll use them for something else. On that, so this is the same sticker right back here, just in different colors. I have a silver, pink, blue, pink, and gold on that and these ones came in i don't think i bought all the colors in this one but there's yellow blue red pink and green i might have gotten all the colors in oh i don't think i was on camera for that on that so that is everything i have bought so far i'm here for a couple more days i'm going to consolidate everything down i don't think i'm going to buy anymore because <laughs> i don't think i have any more room in my luggage on that so i hope that was helpful um i hope you like it oh i did get two when you're at dollar tree you can get water so i bought um that i like aquafina and my sister bought two other different kinds of water and she got some frozen lemon stuff that they had that's really yummy it was like a frozen dessert um so um uh, i'm sure there's stuff i'm forgetting because i'm sure there's stuff around the room um that i uh yeah yeah that's it oh right down here this isn't dollar tree but i got this teeny little bottle was it vons we went to vons today and these were 50 cents so i grabbed this as a stocking stuffer for my husband because i thought that was cool so um i actually don't think i've tried to heat but i know that a lot of people love it so okay so there it is i hope you like it i hope it was helpful i hope that wherever and whenever you're at you're having a great time and Thanks for watching.